Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Takeout. But first, let's talk about why you might want to use it, especially if you're a teacher at this time of year. Let's say you're changing school districts or you're retiring or you're moving on outside of your school district in some way and you want to take some of your important Google materials with you. You could individually download a whole bunch of Google Drive folders and files or you could use Google Takeout to do it for you. Let's go ahead and take a look at it how to do this. So go to takeout.google.com and make sure you're signed in to the account from which you want to download your materials. And you'll see here there's 57 different Google services connected to this particular account that I'm using. I don't want the, the information from all 57 services. So I'm gonna deselect all of them and then go in and manually select the things that I want. Like perhaps I want to keep all my Chrome bookmarks. Uh, now I probably don't need my Google Classroom settings for the new school that I'm going to next year. So I'm gonna leave that unchecked. And let's say that uh, Google Drive has all of the slideshows and the documents that I've made over the years. I definitely want to keep those. So let's select that one. I don't need anything from my Google chat. Uh, my Google photos, I use my personal Google account, not my work Google account for that. So don't need to download those. And you can see all the other ones that I have connected here that I may or may not want to download. Like Google's My Maps. I do make a lot of things in My Maps that I could reuse in the future with students. So I'm going to download those. You can see some other options that I have there. Now, let's go to the next step. And I'm going to get a download link via email. You can see I could also add it to Drive. I could add it directly to OneDrive if I already have a Microsoft OneDrive account set up. I could add it directly to OneDrive or to Box or Dropbox. But in this case here, I'm not sure where I'm gonna use it in the future. So I'm just gonna get a download link via email. And I'm gonna export once as a zip file. And let's say I'm gonna make it a four gig file. And we'll see that little uh, notification that exports larger than this will be split into multiple files. I'm gonna make that back there at a two gig file size. Now create the export and let's wait for this export to happen. Now you'll see the little warning that this process can take a long time, possibly hours or days to complete. So you do have to be patient, wait for the email. And once you have the email, you can download that zip file that has all that Google takeout information all the things that you have selected now i've previously made other videos on this topic and i have a couple of those linked up down below but that's how you can use google takeout in 2023 as always for more things like this please visit practicaledtech.com or subscribe to my youtube channel